integer bingo, addition and subtraction. This is the winter version. So this is a digital bingo game. All the instructions are on slide two. There are 26 different bingo cards. If you have more than 26 students, just click on one of the thumbnails on the left hand side, come up here to slide and duplicate. You can duplicate as many different slides as you need. All of the problems that you're going to call out to the students are on slide three. So as you use them, just click and hold on the edge and then move them to the right hand side. And that way you know which ones you've used. At the end of the game, all you need to do is come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly, everything goes right back into place. I give the students editing rights so they can scroll up and down till they find the bingo card that they want. I have my students click in one of the chips and just type their name or initials. And that way the other students know that this board's been claimed and they need to go find another one. So as you're calling these out to the students, they're going to find their solution on their, sl on their slide or their bingo board. They're going to click and hold on one of the chips and move it to cover the answer. Once they get five in a row, they can call out bingo. If you want to check their answers, just have them move these chips to the side, and then that way you can check and see if their answers are correct. At the end of the game, the students can come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly. All the chips go back into place and their name comes off the chip. So um, that way they can play again. They could scroll up and down, find a different bingo card, and they can play again.